Hi everyone, my name is Seika and welcome to part 5 of my Undertale Let's Play. Um, we had just gotten done with um, another one of Papyrus's puzzles and we saw the lesser dog trying to, at least I believe it's lesser dog, trying to make some snow dogs and obviously they had disastrous results. Poor things. Alright, and now we are stuck with another puzzle. Alright, what's down here? Oh my god. It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sands written on it in red marker. Oh my god. Okay, let's see if I can figure this out. Okay, there we go. Yeah, we go down. If anyone has played the, like, any of the Pokemon games that's got sliding ice puzzles. Oh, okay. I like how the game just, like, pauses music, making it seem like there's something bad gonna happen. Uh, but yeah, have you played any of the... Oh my god, was that a bird? That was a snowbird. Snow doggy! Any other things? I think that was a hat. We're just gonna go with a hat on that one. Let's see what's this way. I uh, don't know what that way is. Let's go down here. I try to thought. Yeah, if you played any of the Pokemon games and you know the sliding ice puzzles, yeah, they're a real pain in the butt. Oh, hi, Sans again. What's up? What's up? Nothing much. Those are kind of creepy. Uh. Oh, what a run to to. Gift Trot confronts you. Check. Gift Trot. Seven attack, three defense. Some teens decorated it as a prank. Is this funny? This is funny to you. Oh, poor ah! Ah! Oh, jeez, I'm so bad. Gift Trot limits its lack of hands. Oh, poor thing. We are gonna undecorate him. You remove the small, confused dog. Oh my God, that's a that's a little better. Oh, 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 oh! Let me eat something. I definitely. Uh, <laughs> You look nice today. Your HP was maxed out. Don't put any more on me. I totally did the voice wrong. Ah! Ah! Oh! No! Ah, Gift Trot is slightly less irritated. Okay, let's keep undecorating. You removed a childhood photograph of Snow, Great Snow Drake and his parent. Oh my god. That's a little... That's a little better. I totally messed up on the... Ah! Woo! I am horrible at this. Ah, ah. See, gift trot. Nope, not decorate. Undecorate. You removed a lenticular bookmark of a smug teen weepy. A weight has been wet lifted. Gift trot's problems have been taken away. Aw. We're gonna give you a gift. You get 35G because you can't think of an appropriate gift. Aw, you shouldn't have. Or all oh, you shouldn't have. Gift Trot's things. Gift Trot's problems have been taken away. Okay, we can spare him. And earn nothing. Right. Okay, what's up with you, Sans? Are you lost? No, I am exploring. Ooh, pretty. Oh, they squeak like the mouse. I don't think I... Yeah, I don't think... It's a door. Yeah, I actually don't think I can do anything with this door. Yeah. 
I think someone had told me that it was a secret door that has to do with the end credits if you do something right with the end credits. Do you see anything else? Say, are you following me? No, I think you're following me or being creepy or you sure you sure do like to exercise. Oh my god. Wonder if you do you see anything else? Oh my god. That goofy. Oh no! Oh! We are going to undecorate you. That's a little better. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, oh! I actually adapted just dodged them all. Oh, I am amazing for just that turn. Oh, 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 oh! Woo! I am getting better. Okay, undecorate. You remove the striped cane that says, I use this tiny cane to walk on it. Aww. Okay, have it taken away. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and mercy him. Hey, I won 20 gold that time. His face, I just noticed his face becomes creepy when you spare him. Oh my god. Sans. Sans, no. It's a snow puff. Um, actually, we are going to... Item... Illustration of a hug, your HP was maxed out. Uh, and this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Oh my god. Wolf. What's in here? What a tiny doghouse! Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Uh, what about this one? Is it really a snow puff? And uh, what about this one? Behold, a snow puff. Oh my god, it's like they're all sarcastic. Eh, there's 30G inside this. What is this? It's a snow puff. <laughs> oh, oh, that one has a tail. It's a puppy! It squeaks! That! Oh my god. There are puppy faces all over him. There's one on his actual face, one on his beard, and one on his armor on his left. Just, oh my god, in the freaking music. It's the greater dog. We are going to check him. Greater dog, six attack, four defense, is so excited that it thinks fighting is just play. Aww. Oh, you stupid setup! Waiting for your command. Uh. Actually, I don't know how to beat him. Uh, Becky? You call the greater dog. It bounds towards you, flecking slobber into your face. Crap! Oh, I don't like this. Seeking affection. Uh, do I pet him? Greater dog curls up in your lap as it is pet by you. Aw, it gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Aw. Zzz. Then it wakes up. It's so excited. Woo, okay, I dodged that one. It's patting the ground with its front paws. Uh, play? You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Woo! Greater dog wants some TLC. We are gonna pet you. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Your move is slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Oh my god. Woo! Pet capacity is 40%. 
You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with his legs hanging in the air. Oh my god. So can you imagine it just, you know, freaking huge arms and everything? And his little legs just stick straight up in the air. Oh my god. What a cute. Ah! No! Oh! Please don't! Oh! Oh no! Greater dog is content. Please, can I spare you? Oh, thank god. I can spare you. You won! You earned 0 XP and 40 gold. Oh, he gave me kisses! H how can he see? Ugh. Item. An illustration of a hug, your HP was maxed out. I'm doing horrible, oh god. What is this? <gasps> Papyrus! Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. Papyrus, what the freak? And why is there a dog on a rope? When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up! What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now! Please don't. No, 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 no. That, uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, maybe, too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. <laughs> expertly cooked. <laughs> but this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Thank God. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Me. He. Eh? Oh my god. What a cute. Actually, I've also found out. Freaking Flowey, he does follow you everywhere. What a creep. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Do you talk more? Nope. Snowden! Welcome to Snowden! Yay! Welcome to Snowden Town! Yay! Oh! The sight of such a friendly town frills you with determination. Okay. First of all... Um... I am going to... Put the snowman piece in the box. Alright, let's go in the shop. Hello, tra hello, traveler. How may I help you? Let's talk. Care to chat? Say hello. Hiya, welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from, the capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? What to do here? You want to know what to do here at Snowden? Grillby's has food and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Town history. 
Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost or can burrow under the door, forget about it. Your life. Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. Oh, I am so sorry. Suddenly had the yawns and I apologize if they, you heard that small burp. Don't know where that came from. That's life, ain't it? Okay, exit. Uh. Huh? Sounds something. Does this look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you come from, but... If I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'd be out of business in the jiffy. Well, can't sell anything here. But I can buy stuff. Okay, I definitely don't need any attack. Mainly bandana. It has abs on it. Okay, first of all, I need that. Thanks for your purchase. Heals 11 times 2. Eat it twice. Heals 22 is my own recipe. Um, let's see. I'm gonna get... Let's see how much money. Okay. No. Uh. Nope. I don't have enough money. Okay. So I got some good stuff. I just realized I'm slacking in the chair. I'm just like, instead of standing up straight, because I'm looking at myself right now, like, oh, I was just going, oh. Yeah, I need to stand up a bit straight. Or sit up a bit straighter. Bye now. Come again sometime. Okay. Oh, the inn. Oh, what a cute little thing. Oh, it says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. What's maximum HP? Oh. Welcome to Snow. Let's see. Welcome to Snowden, Snowden's premier hotel. One night is 80G. I know I don't have the money, but I want to try to stay. You don't even have 80G? Oh, you poor thing. I can only imagine what you've been through. Sorry about that. I still got uh, I still got an annoying cough that will not go away. I bet you all these voices I'm trying to do is not helping. You can you can sleep there for free, okay? Sleep in. Wow. How am I supposed to sleep through all that? And what the heck are they? Are they eggs or something? I mean, they have circle heads. I mean, I don't know. Oh, yeah, you look like you had a great sleep. I think I changed your voice on her all of a sudden, too. Which is incredible because you are only up there for about two minutes. Feel free to come back if you get tired. Oh, thank you. Can I go up? Nope, apparently not. Let's see. Don't want to walk to the other side of town? Try the under snow tunnels. They're efficiently, efic efficiently laid out. I cannot speak. Alright, let's see. Lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. 
What about her? She's just walking. She's a bunny walking a bunny. Nothing creepy about that at all. Oh, is it my little cinnamon? Just or cinnamon? Cinnamon? Wow, I cannot talk. Is it my little cinnamon? Just the cutest. Bun buns are so adorable. <laughs> oh my god. Bun 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 bun. Oh my god, that's so cute. Local teens tormented the local monster by decorating his tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath the decorated tree. It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. Let's see. Aww. Cute! How should I do his voice? Yo. Yeah. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Oh my gosh, we're wearing striped shirts. We are both awesome and amazing. Real bees. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. Oh my god, what the heck. Oh, look at all these people. What are you? You better where I go. It's the same menu, the same people. Yo, I want new trees and ha 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 guys. You are creepy. Hmm, that's what you want to do different from monster food. It does things like spoil, and when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I love to try it sometime. Got you. The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I heard they're starting to going to start moving here. Hmm. I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip onto their butts. Okay, that would be funny. The jukebox is broken. Well, that's disappointing. Hey, what about you guys? We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. Yeah. We love bones. Oh wait, that was a female. Oh wait. They both say the same thing. Okay. Oh, there's a smoky, the bone smoking dog. I'm thinking of getting a spike color to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. He just farted. And I'm gonna guess since he's... Yeah, he just farted. What about you? I bet you that's Lesser Dog. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. Oh my god. Hey, I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with the fish. You're the one that put the fishy line, and you look so creepy. What about you, duck thingy? Those dogs, those dogs are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. Okay, what well, about this flaming dude? Dot, dot, dot. Grills, Grills be said that he'd offer you, he offer you a water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. Well, since he's kind of a, a flame, a literal little flame, I don't blame him. Oh, 
you're like a little mouse with a huge scarf. That is so cute. Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. Dreariness crowding like a sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. What about you? We all... We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? You know, that is actually very good advice. What's up here? Oh, what is up here? Let's play Monsters and Humans. What's that? You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are ya? Wait, are those rocks playing? Ah, uh, to be young again. The world sure felt boundless. Oh my gosh, are those... Is that snow? Ah, uh, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, uh, my patience rewards me. Oh my god, he loves knocks. What the heck? Is there a reason for this? What's up here? No. Oh, nothing. Okay. Going back. Oh, the library. Library. Oh my god, they misspelled it. Hey! Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. Oh my god. It's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool as heck. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on that person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kind of sick of writing this. Oh my god. And I just realized I'm like almost at 30 minutes. I'll finish looking at the library, then I'm gonna save because I am like way over. Oh, wrong button. While monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us. But they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. Oh my god. Here I am, writing this book. A person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry, I'm still writing that one. Oh my god. Because they are made of magic, monsters' bodies are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill, um, let's end the chapter here. Oh, wow. I did not. Wow. Monster History Part 4. Fearing the humans no longer, we moved out of our old city. Home. We braved harsh cold, damp swampland, and searing heat. Until we reached what we now call our capital. New home. Again, Arkeen is really bad at names. Oh my god. Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of. But the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. Huh. That is an interesting read. Definitely explains hmm, a lot of things. And some of the things we'll get to later in the playthrough. Um, I, I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. Golf, golf. When I was young, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a wasted time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. And a little ball monster thing. That look in your eye. 
You're the one that has difficulty solving Junior Jumble, aren't you? Nope. Not me. Okay, I think... Okay, yeah, we're gonna wait for that house. But let me head all the way back to the save point and save it, and then we're gonna... I gotta end the episode here, and we'll continue on later. Oh, there it is. Alright. Alright, we saved. So that was part five, Eric, everybody. Um, so can't wait to show you the next part, which is probably going to be fun. Because it's going to be a difficult thing. So, um, I'll definitely see you guys in the next episode. Um, leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what I need to improve on. Uh, tell me what you like or don't like. Uh, sorry about all the stupid voices. I'm trying to voice out, but I really don't have a range. And I'm not good at voice acting. So, some of them may sound the same. I don't know. I'm bad at it. They say practice makes perfect, right? Who knows? <laughs> Alright, so I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye!